I just looked at that sloth and you were just like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going. There's a sloth <laughs> on the window. Oh, me. Hey, hey, y'all, and welcome to today's video. It's a little impromptu. Audrey and I are out and about. We actually had to go by Lowe's and pick up a few more things. We started on our walkway to our back porch, and we got most everything we needed yesterday. We needed a few more bags of rocks and a few more stakes for the border that we put on it. So we went and picked those things up, and while we were out, I thought, let's do a little Easter shopping. The little boys are not with me. I am very rarely out and about without the kids, and Audrey likes to pick some of her own things anyway, so... We're going to go in Dollar Tree, then we're going to head over to Walmart and see what they have for Easter, for springtime, to help the Easter Bunny out a little bit. Well, we're going to go in and see what we see, and then I'll show you if we're able to find find some things, which I'm pretty sure we will will be able to. I'll show you what we ended up getting. Just in case you're new, I'm Tiffany, and this is our small town life, and I have five children. Audrey is my oldest. She is 13 all the way down to Fletcher who is two months old. So I have Audrey, Easton, Hudson, Wyatt, and Fletcher. And that's who we'll be Easter shopping for. like this Dollar Tree has a lot of um, flower beauty products some matte lipstick what else did we see I saw something else too oh yeah let me see it and a primer we found a lot of good stuff in the Dollar Tree we're gonna run in Walmart now and see what we see we're gonna look for Fletcher a stuffed animal it's hard to get for a two month old but some probably a stuffed animal and then something for baskets i usually try to do baskets that they can like play with because we don't have baskets that we keep and use over and over so we'll just have to see what we see separating everybody's things out into their buckets and we're gonna do a haul from the car because if I go home and I try to do a haul the boys are gonna want to see what I've got <laughs> so a car haul it is let's go youngest to oldest so we'll start with Fletcher who's two months old Billy he'll have turned three months old right before Easter and y'all it is hard to get for a baby that small there's nothing that he needs and I don't like to buy just for the sake of buying so for Fletcher this is his bucket and we got the buckets at Walmart all of the buckets we got from Walmart and the kids will take these outside and play with them Audrey will probably use hers to put some things in, in her room if she wants to she doesn't have to uh, just cheap buckets and for Fletcher, we got a book. It's called God Made Earth. And this was from Dollar Tree. And then we got him a stuffed animal. This rabbit from Walmart. And that's all we're going to do for him. Keep it simple. Because he just doesn't need much at his age. Here's Wyatt. And we got him a dinosaur bucket. And then inside, we got this from dollar tree it's a spidey toy 
this is the kind of thing that I normally wouldn't get, but at the same time, I think he'll really enjoy it and he'll play with it. He'll throw it around. He is all about some spidey right now. So, while this may seem like a cutesy toy that wouldn't get much use for him, I think he's really going to enjoy it and it'll be special. Then we got him this Paint with Water Forest book. And he can sit down and do this while I'm doing school with the older boys and some paint brushes to go with it. And then, like I said, he's all into Spidey, so he got him a Spidey coloring book. Again, he can sit and do that while we're doing school. He can do his school. Is that... Oh, finger paint. He loves his bath... If he hears the bath running, y'all, he comes running so fast if he hears that water going. He loves the bath, doesn't he, y'all? Yes, yeah, so we got him some finger paint for the bathtub in sea green and then some starburst jelly beans and popcorn it's cake batter popcorn and everything of his came from dollar tree except for the bucket here is huddy's bucket he got the blue camo bucket and then everything else came from dollar tree the buckets from walmart everything else from dollar tree Get him a couple of these learning to read books. He'll be able to sit down and read these by himself, no problem, and he'll enjoy it. It's two Sid the Science Kid books. Both of the boys are getting, both of the older boys are getting some of these, what do you call them, wiffle balls? Is that what they are? They play with these all the time out in the yard with the plastic bats. We go through them pretty quick. So you're going to see they're both getting some of those. As a matter of fact, I think Justin had to get one down off the house last night, off the roof. Boys like to play with the mitts that have the Velcro, and you throw the ball and it sticks to the Velcro. This one is suction cups. I don't know, I thought that was pretty neat, so that's going in Huddy's. I don't think those will tear as easy because you know, like, the Velcro, the Velcro gets yeah. stringy. Yeah, so maybe that'll do better. Some Kool-Aid jelly beans. A chocolate cross and that is Huddy's things don't think I mentioned but Wyatt the bucket you saw before this one he is one and then Huddy is seven now Easton my 11 year old he has a sports bucket and then everything else is from Dollar Tree one of these footballs that they can throw around in the yard some more of those wiffle balls I think, was it last Easter that they got some of these comic books and really liked them? And so, we got two of the Star Wars comics for him. This is something that he can, you know, read as part of his daily individual reading or something for school. And he'll think that's fun. And then, some now and later jelly beans. I bet those are good. And his chocolate cross. I like now and laters. I don't know. I like now and later a lot. Like the last time I ate now and later, it made my tongue like raw. But it was at your math tournament. I ate, but now I ate almost like a whole pack. <laughs> <laughs> but they made my tongue like feel raw. It was strange. Now Audrey's. She got this colorful bucket. And from Walmart, she also got this Blossom roll-on, like, roll-on perfume. It has little flowers in it. What scent did you pick? Island hibiscus. Is that hibiscus? Hibiscus. You say what? Hibiscus. 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 Tomato, tomato. Potato, potato. <laughs> potato, potato. Pecan, pecan. Pecan, pecan. It just depends on who's saying it. What's another word that can be said? What's some other words that can be pronounced different ways? I don't know. You tell me. And everything else is from Dollar Tree. She picked some of the Bolero shampoo and conditioner. What is this scent? Papaya, green tea, and sunflower oil. A Sudoku, you go Sudoku, Sudoku, <laughs> which is probably how it's supposed to be pronounced. Sud 
Yeah. It has a U. Sudoku. 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 <laughs> One of these. Sweet tart jelly bean. And a white chocolate cross. Oh, crinkle, crinkle. Two bags of the grass, Easter grass, to put in the bottom. We'll just split it up between all the buckets so there's a little something in the bottom of it. Not that it's necessary, but at the same time, is it an Easter basket without Easter grass? No. And that's what our kiddos are going to be getting for Easter. I think they'll enjoy it and be excited about it. And it'll be a nice little treat for them. Thank you for hanging out with us and doing a little shopping today. We love you. We appreciate you. We'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all.